Gabapentin is an anticonvulsant medication that is mostly used to treat nerve pain. In this mnemonic video, we'll cover important facts about gabapentin so you'll be ready come test day. It's garbage day and the garbage truck just pulled up outside to grab the garbage from this dumpster. The garbage man is trying to find a working pen, but he keeps finding dud after dud. He's throwing all these failed pens into the garbage. You can use the garbage and pens, or garbage pens, if you will, to help you remember the drug gabapentin. Get it? Garbage pen for gabapentin? Let's continue through the mnemonic to learn more about gabapentin's clinical uses and side effects. You know how the garbage trucks always slam the garbage cans back onto the ground after dumping the garbage? Well, this specific dumpster has been designed to protect itself from damage, with some big shocks to absorb the shaking impact. When the truck puts down this dumpster, it's smooth and quiet because of all the anti-shake shocks. Let these anti-shake shocks remind you that gabapentin is an anticonvulsant and can be used to treat seizures. Because these shocks here stop shaking, just like gabapentin stops shaking associated with seizures. Get it? Specifically, gabapentin is effective in treating partial seizures, but that actually isn't its most common clinical use, so let's talk about that next. What's taking the truck so long to dump the garbage full of pens? Looks like there's a sparking wire on the side of the truck, so the garbage man hopped out of the truck to document the problem. A frayed sparking wire is our recurring symbol for peripheral neuropathy, because nerves are kind of like wires, so frayed wires should remind you of damaged nerves, right? Gabapentin is used to treat peripheral neuropathy and other sources of nerve pain. This typically manifests as numbness, loss of sensation, or pain in the distal extremities. Now, let's move on to one major side effect of gabapentin. The garbage man is taking so long to find a working pen and fix the sparking wire that his partner has fallen asleep right there in the garbage truck. The sleeping partner can help you remember that gabapentin can cause drowsiness and sedation. Like with all medications that cause drowsiness, you'll want to warn the patient to avoid driving until they know how they are affected by gabapentin. You will also want to keep a close eye on your older patients because the sedative effects may place them at a higher risk for falls. All right, that's all for this mnemonic. Let's wrap up so we can get away from all this smelly garbage. Gabapentin is an anticonvulsant medication that is used to treat seizures, but more commonly prescribed to treat peripheral neuropathy and other neuropathic pain. The biggest side effect of gabapentin is drowsiness and sedation. And now we're actually done with gabapentin. See you next time. Thanks for watching. For more videos like this one, subscribe to our channel and check out our newest lessons. For more resources on this topic, including fact lists and interactive review images, click the image next to the More Here arrow. I'll see you next time.